please come forward, light the candle. Thank y'all very much. We'll get our sound off in just a second.
Good afternoon. Please stand. I would like to our national anthem. We are also asking to praise tonight for our graduates due to the delicate nature of their hats. Some of those will have to leave those on. But we must 
never forget the people who raised us, the community that supported us, and the world that shaped us. We must never forget the change we have created. We must continue to be visionaries. We must continue to change the circumstances around us. We must always shoot for the moon so we can land among the stars. Congratulations, Class 2023. We did it.
I will be successful because of the love and lessons that these people have given to me. Surrounding yourself with good people who lift you up is the best decision you can ever make for your fulfillment, more than any job offer you could ever accept or purchase you can make. No matter what, never forget what's important in life, what's the most important. For the past year, I've worn a simple metal cross necklace around my neck. It represents my promise to God that no matter how many times I fall into temptation, I'll do everything I can to love God and love people with the same grace and mercy that He has shown me time and time and time again. I wear it so if God allows me to another person's good graces, then they will know that God is to credit for the way that I live my life. And I pray that one day in heaven, when I'm in heaven, people will remember me as the type of person that treated people right, loved unconditionally, by truth and grace. That's what gives my life fulfillment. Leaving today, I just want you all to know that truly I love all of you, and it has been such a blessing to grow with you these last several years. We've been through a global pandemic, a rising inflation, even a little war across the world. There's no doubt in my mind that no matter where we go in life, we can handle anything that is thrown our way, anything. But it's our choice now what we do moving forward, what we pursue. I'll leave you with this. Jeremiah 29 11 says, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and future. Underneath all the awards and decorations that we have on, we're all wearing the same cap and gown. This is a fresh start for every single one of us. So what kind of life are we going to choose to live? Let's make it a good one. Thank you. Yeah, but 
you should choose to pursue, you know, whether that be joining the military, learning a trade, going to a four-year degree, or joining the workforce, using the skills you've learned throughout your high school career. Everyone here is going to do great because you've gone through this program and we've learned everything you need to learn. And it's going to be okay, no matter how big it's here, the change may be. Thank you. And sorry about that. The salutatory for the Erie County High School Class 2023 is Jaden Brown. <laughs> Jaden is the daughter of Jennifer McCray, and Jaden has been involved in many clubs while she was at GCHS. She was a founding member and president of the GCHS Student Council. She served as president of the Future Business Leaders of America and will go on to compete in Insurance and Risk Management at the National Leadership Conference in Atlanta, Georgia this June. Jalen is both Beta Club and Science Club Treasurer, and additionally, she was a member of the National Honor Society Book Club, Girls Who Code, Academic Team, and the Kentucky YMCA. Jalen plans on pursuing her education because she's already completed 18 college credit hours through AP and dual credit courses, she has worked at, the, at Katie Farley State Farm for more than a year and is currently pursuing her property and casualty insurance license. And she will attend Eastern Kentucky University in the fall and major in criminal justice with a minor in insurance and risk management on a full tuition merit tier one scholarship. Please welcome Jalen Gray. Of some kind, and at times we've worn together. 
We lost a dear member of our class, and I know Emily Jane is smiling down on us, watching her friends anxiously anticipate walking across the stage. We've all lost somebody, and for many, these are the ones that leave the greatest impact. When you walk in just a few minutes, congratulate yourself, and then consider the sacrifices your village has made to get you here tonight. Before you leave, remind yourself of the phrase, it takes a village to raise a child. Say thank you to those that contributed to your successes, and smile while doing it. Strive to develop an attitude of gratitude towards those around you, because none of us could have done it alone. Thank you, class of 2023, and congratulations.
Isabella Montgomery.
Sydney Travis.
graduate from the American Army High School. Thank you, Dr.